Hi everyone, my name is Thomas, art lead on the F100 Super Saber. I'd like to share a look into the work being done to bring the most accurate rendition of the Super Saber to you. Photogrammetry has proven to be an invaluable resource in a recreation of the cockpit. What you're seeing now is the nearly completed high resolution geometry that will then be baked down into the low resolution in-game mesh. To establish a baseline for later texturing work and build a material library we can quickly pull from, we've also begun texturing select parts of the cockpit. The ARC-34 radio found in most Super Sabers contains enough variation in parts to begin building such material libraries. We would also like to showcase the initial renders and animation tests of our pilot model. As work continues, the accuracy and fine details are being refined to deliver a historically accurate representation of a Cold War era Hun pilot. The Sabre will introduce an advanced, fully functional gun camera system designed to simulate the operational capabilities of the equipment. The Hun historically supported a variety of camera types, including the gun sight, belly mounted, and underwing configurations. We aim to include all three, each model to reflect their operational parameters and synchronization with the weapon system. Pilots can utilize in-cockpit controls to operate the gun sight camera equipment. The footage you capture can be replayed within the track files or exported as standalone video. The module also allows players to customize their aircraft with three fuel probe configurations. The standard bent probe, an alternate straight probe, or the option to remove it entirely. The fuel probe can be swapped on the ramp, giving you full control over your flight configuration. Players can also select two afterburner configurations, each with unique performance characteristics. The Dash 21 is part of the aircraft's original configuration. It was known for being prone to issues such as inconsistent operation and reduced reliability during extended use. The Dash 23 was developed for the F-102 and later retrofitted to the Hun. The superior design incorporates structural and performance improvements that enhance the reliability and reduced operational inefficiencies. Afterburner selection is set by the mission creator via the mission editor and cannot be changed during gameplay. As development progresses, we remain committed to refining and optimizing unique features and module performance. We had an incredible opportunity to attend the Wings Over Houston Air Show, where we worked closely with the Collings Foundation F-100F Super Saber. 
The main focus of our efforts was recording authentic, high quality audio directly from the cockpit. To achieve this, we utilized two Rode condenser microphones, which were strategically positioned to record the intricate sounds of the cockpit environment. The condensers were complemented by a Zoom H6 recorder equipped with stereo mics. We also mounted a GoPro with its media kit microphone for every flight. This invaluable footage showcased the cockpit systems in real time, providing rare insights into the operational intricacies of the jet. When a damaged tire threatened to sideline the aircraft between shows, we jumped in to help Crew Chief Chris with the repairs. We carefully jacked up the left side of the jet on the ramp and began removing the brakes. This gave us an opportunity to examine the anti-skid system and how the brake mechanisms operate. Once the wheel was removed, we transferred components to the spare and prepared to reassemble the gear. The entire crew worked well into the night under floodlights and the glow of a few flashlights, determined to complete the repair. By the end of the night, the wheel was replaced, the brakes reassembled, and the F-100 was ready to take flight again. Beyond the flights, we had the privilege of joining the ground crew, assisting with startup operations like ground air and electrical power. Being part of this process was an incredible honor. With so few F-100s still flying today, having the chance to work so closely with this iconic aircraft is a once in a lifetime opportunity. I wanna thank the Collins Foundation and the crew for allowing us access to their incredible F-100F. We came away with a deeper connection to this legendary aircraft and its enduring story. In order to make the Super Sabre flight model as accurate as possible, we developed our own physics and aircraft simulation system. This in-house physics simulation enables us to step through simulation frames in seconds while storing every parameter for detailed analysis. It flawlessly replicates tests based on real-world data, enabling highly accurate comparisons with our simulation output. We can manipulate every aspect of the aircraft, from flight controls to engines and hydraulics during each test. For example, we can run hundreds of tests, adjust the flight model data, and rerun the exact tests in seconds to observe how specific changes impact aircraft dynamics and performance. This approach allows us to match real-world performance and dynamic responses with precision, without manually flying after data adjustments. By leveraging thousands of test points, the F-100 flight model will achieve unmatched fidelity, going beyond the limits of just using source coefficient data. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Stay tuned for more insights and progress as we continue down the road to realism.